Hey what's up guys, it's Kazoo here and welcome to episode 3 of my Road to Glory series on the FIFA World Cup game add-on and uh, we're gonna of course start off by going into the first game of the episode and that is the semi-finals of the tournament of the World Cup. Hopefully we can win that game because then we will move on to the final which would be absolutely awesome but uh, before we do go into our first game I think I have to make a few changes because we did that in the previous episode of course that one will be in the description down below in case you missed it so um, as you can see we're gonna make a few substitutions and I'll be back in a second. Alright guys, so we're back and I changed the formation back to the 4 and 2 and 2 formation with the two center mids on the right and left hand side and it's pretty much the same team that we used uh, in the episode 1 so um, yeah, this is the team that we're gonna play with hopefully we can win this game and hopefully we can finally pick up a European goalkeeper because uh, Bravo is only on 3 chemistry he's playing very good for us but I really want a, a better goalkeeper so um, yeah, we're going to the first game of the episode which will be the semi-finals of course let's see what kind of team he has 100 chemistry Oh, I think he has a pretty strong team. Oh my god, he has a very, very strong team. He has so many good players. Look at that team. Messi, Ronaldo, Iniesta, Aguero, Hulk, Fidal. His defense as well with Ramos, Thiago Silva, Neuer. Oh my god, he has an amazing team. Alright guys, here we go. Let's see uh, how this game will go. Go on, Eduardo. There we go, PC. Oh, whoa! What a goal with a left back! Or left mid, or whatever. Whoa, what a goal! <laughs> He's probably the worst player that we have in our team. <laughs> Look at the curve, Jesus. That's a crazy goal. 1 0 it is. That's a great ball to Defoe. Can we chip his goalkeeper? Oh, that was so close. Ah, there he goes for Hulk, plays it through to Vidal, no way, oh what a tackle, what a tackle, come on, had that one, nice, no way, oh my god, wow, no way, oh my god, that's a nice goal by Ronaldo, that's a nice goal, alright, so that's half time and as you can see from the stats as well, he had two shots on target, he managed to score one, we had one shot on target and we managed to score from it as well, so not really an exciting half, he had most of the possession as well, um, hopefully we can do a whole lot better because I really really want to go to the final of this tournament. What the hell happened? Please tell me it's not me, please tell me it's not me. I still got my connection on my PC. Rest huh? What? Apparently he lost his connection, but we still have to play. What the hell? <laughs> All right, so apparently my opponent lost his connection um, because I still have internet on my PC. And it also says that we still have to play the semi-final once again. So we're gonna do that now and hopefully we, uh, we will cop against a less better opponent because the opponent that we just played had an insane team with Ronaldo, Messi, etc. Um, do we have to change anything? I don't think we have to. Alright, so here we go then into the second game of the episode. Here we go, second game of the episode. Let's see what kind of team he has. Once again, 100 chemistry. And he has. He's playing 3 5 2. Very good defense, very good midfield. Very good attacking as well with Modric, Mansukic, Benzema. Pacey, uh, Pacey right mid, Pacey left mid. Alright, let's see how it goes. Alright, let's see if we can... Hmm. I think I'm gonna lay it off, I think. Yes, I'm gonna lay it off to Pjanic and uh, let's see how it goes. Oh, so close! Just wide! Go on, Defoe. Got in, shoot! Yes, 1-0! Not really a skill goal, but nice fake shot and uh, make it 1-0. Nice. No way. Nice. Go on, Defoe. Go on, Defoe. Oh my god, what a save from his goalkeeper. That should have been a 2-0. That should have been a 2-0.
No, no, come on. Don't let him cross in. For fuck's sake, man. Please, come on. Yes! <laughs> we get so lucky. 86 minute header with Rakitic. Please, just not concede now. Please, not concede. Please, do not concede. Yes! We won the game with 2 1. A header by Rakitic. Not the nicest goal, but I'll take it, man. If that's how we reach the final, then uh, hopefully we can uh, we can win it too. But anyway, um, we won the game with 2-1. I think it was a pretty even game. It was a tough game though, because um, yeah, my opponent had a few chances as well. We had a few chances too. So I guess, uh, like I said, it was a pretty even game, uh, even though uh, we uh, we won the game at the very uh, very late stage of the game. But anyway, um, we're gonna move into the stats. As you can see right here, we uh, we move on to the final. We won the semi-final, which is absolutely awesome. And uh, yeah, we're gonna move into the stats. And as you can see. He had a few more shots on target, uh, we had a little bit more possession, but um, yeah, the game felt like it uh, It was pretty even. Alright, so apparently we also got a pack from the game that we already played, uh, where my opponent uh, lost his connection, I think he did. But um, yeah, we're gonna op open those uh, two first, and then we're gonna open two 5k packs. So uh, let's see what we do get from these packs, where we only get one player. Hopefully we can uh, get a, a decent player. A goalkeeper from Europe would be, uh, would be fine. And uh, we do get Maxwell there from Brazil, who is, uh, I think, going to the World Cup, actually. So uh, we're gonna put him in the collection book later on in this episode. Um, but um, yeah, we're gonna move on to the second pack here. The second one player pack. Which player do we get this time? Let's see. We do get a Korean player. The center back, 78 pace. He looks alright, I guess. He looks pretty alright. Alright, here we go. First 5k pack of the episode. And we do get a lot of players, actually. Oh, we do get Mario Goetze. We're gonna, of course, use him in our team. Alright, here we go. Final pack. And we do get Kameni, another goalkeeper. We also got Paredes there from Chile. And another Korean player. So, um, yeah, the first pack was pretty decent. Uh, we got Mario Goetze. Definitely gonna use him. In, a, in our squad and uh, second pack wasn't really the best also we got a duplicate once again Ziegler that we just got in a pack but uh, anyway we're gonna move on to our club and make a few uh, changes of course because we got Mario Goods and we're gonna try to put him in our team all right guys so this is a team I came up with as you can see in the 4 2 3 1 formation uh, once again I decided to, uh, to change the formation just a little bit because I want to put Walcott and also Sam uh, in this team on the wing so uh, this is the team as you can see here as well as center attacking mate we have our new signing or new signing the new player that we got in a pack that is Mario Goods so of course with four star skill moves so uh, we go into the final of the World Cup hopefully we can win this game because then we get to open three packs which is absolutely awesome all right, 100 chemistry, 86 rated, and he has, come on, Luis Suarez, Sanchez, Neymar, Oscar, Cuadrado, Thiago Silva, David Luiz. He has a very, very good uh, South American team. No way, not again. Ah, Always those over-the-top through balls, man. And once again, my defense is just looking awful. This is Alexis Sanchez. No way. <laughs> he just completely dumbed me there with Suarez. <laughs> oh my god. Nah, not again. Come on. Oh my god, man. These over the top through balls, they're just impossible to defend. Look. 3 0. Are you serious? Look, it's just so easy. What the fuck, man? Where's my defense? 4-0. Are you serious, man? Well, we got a goal, but... I don't care, to be honest. It was a nice goal, though. But. Look at my defense, man. He just does one scoop turn and he's just past them. Look, I can't do anything. <laughs> this team is just way too overpowered, man, to play against. Especially with the team I have. 
Suarez and Sanchez up top. All right, guys. So that game we got absolutely smashed. We lost five one against this insane uh, South American team, and yeah, I can't really do anything about it. As you can see, uh, scored two goals with uh, Suarez, scored two goals with Sanchez, who was actually uh, man of the match the other day, so he got a big upgrade. But um, yeah, we lost the final. Hopefully, we can do it uh, better next time because yeah. My opponent's team was just absolutely amazing and uh, he was a very good player as well, so yeah, fair play to him. Here you can see it as well, we got absolutely dominated. Uh, he had more possession, more shots on target as well. Uh, look at his uh, shots in total, 17 and then 9 on target. But uh, anyway guys, we're going to move into the collection book and uh, we're going to see which players we had in the packs are going to the World Cup, so I'll see you guys there. Alright then guys, welcome to the second part of the series. Once again, it is a collection book and uh, we're going to start off here straight away with Brazil because we finally got our first player and that is of course Maxwell, as you can see, the left back. Then uh, we're going to move on to Croatia and we got our first European goalkeeper. He might not be the best, as you can see, only 67 rated, but he's from Europe so uh, we can uh, we can put him into our squad. Then uh, we move on to Iran and they've probably played the most boring game so far in the World Cup against Nigeria, but nonetheless though, we picked up two players from their nation. Then we move on to the final one that is Germany and we of course uh, picked up the man uh, the man himself Mario Goetz 85 rated so uh, this is how it looks right now as you can see it is once again Australia taking the lead just like in the previous episodes and we have two runners up Croatia and also uh, Bosnia we also finally got a player from uh, from the host nation that is of course Brazil but uh, anyway guys that is pretty much the end of the episode hope you enjoyed it if you did then make sure to leave a like would be very much appreciated and uh, if you can hit 1000 likes that would be absolutely awesome so I'd like to thank you guys very much for watching and I will see you guys later. Bye-bye. Mm.